In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to delete a stubborn blank page in a Google Doc. We've all been there, you're working on a document, everything is looking perfect. And suddenly there's an unexpected blank page just sitting there, refusing to leave. It can be quite frustrating, especially if you're trying to get that polished, professional look for your document. But not to worry, today we'll tackle this common issue together. And by the end of this video, you'll be able to say goodbye to unwanted blank pages for good. First, let's navigate to Google Docs by typing docs.google.com into your web browser. A word of caution, make sure you're logged into your Google account so you can access all your documents without any hiccups. Once you're in Google Docs, go ahead and open the document that contains the blank page you want to eliminate. Now that you have your document open, take a moment to scroll through and locate that troublesome blank page. Sometimes it hides in plain sight. Other times, it may be lurking near the end of your document. Look for those extra large spaces that signal its presence. It could be that you've made some formatting changes without noticing, like inserting extra paragraph breaks or tables. So give your document a good scan. Now, here's where the magic happens. Once you've zeroed in on the phantom page, position your cursor and carefully double-click right on that unwanted page. You might notice a faint highlight appear, or you might just see your cursor blinking there, indicating that you have selected it. Once you've done that, it's time for a bit of right-click magic. Hover your mouse anywhere over the blank page and right-click. A menu will pop up with several options, but the one we are interested in is Delete. Select Delete from the list. With this action, the unwanted blank page should vanish before your eyes. Let me reassure you, this process doesn't affect your typed content or previously added formatting elsewhere in the document. You'll find that your document maintains its flow and structure, minus that frustrating gap. It's that simple. A few clicks and you're done. And there you have it. No more pesky blank pages ruining the look of your document. With these quick and easy steps, you're now equipped to handle this issue whenever it appears. Remember, it's all about knowing your tools and making them work for you. So go ahead, check your document and give this method a try to see the results for yourself. Thank you for tuning in and I hope you found this tutorial helpful. Happy writing and see you in the next video.